Good afternoon and thanks for joining us for Living Local, your lifestyle show for everything Charleston and beyond. I'm Ashley Mazervi. It's Medical Monday at East Cooper Medical Center and today we're discussing their breastfeeding class, one of many opportunities you'll find here as women across the low country prepare for motherhood. Medical Monday, sponsored by East Cooper Medical Center. Joining us today, Kelsey Haynes. She is a lactation consultant here at East Cooper Medical Center. Thanks for having me today. Thank you for having me. All right, today we're talking about breastfeeding, a topic that many new moms or not moms to be, as well as moms who maybe have already had their first kid and are having to deal with it again. First off, tell us about the benefits of doing it. Well, it's beneficial to both mom and baby. Um, for a baby, it reduces the risk of sudden infant death syndrome. It reduces um, ear infections. Um, it can help just the baby not get sick as often in that first year of life. And for mom, it can reduce diabetes and some cancers. And I've heard, I mean, that it's also good bonding, as far as like, yeah. well, bonding, and I'm gonna take it a little vain here, but it also, is good for losing weight after yes. baby. Yeah. Right? I mean, people like that's things that mom wants, you know, want to know. Um, so, sh should every new mom be breastfeeding? It, best, breastfeeding is very beneficial for both mom and baby, but you have to do what's best for every woman and their situation. But if they can choose to breastfeed, that's the best thing to do. How do you decide that if you're talking to? a new mom and there, because I mean, it can be super stressful, right? Right, I mean, you have to look at the whole picture. You have to look at what mom's needs are, what baby's needs are, and what mom's actual wants are, and kind of figure out from there what would be best. What are some of the common things you run into when you're dealing with this? I mean, this is something that women talk about all the time. Mm -hmm. Some women feel judged if they don't do it long enough or they don't do it at all. So how do you kind of ease their mind with that? Well, you know, I think it's really easy for them to feel that way, especially having breastfed myself. But most, if you see every mom is going through the exact same things, like, you know, whether it's latching problems or being super tired or mm -hmm. any of those kinds of things, just kind of knowing and getting involved in a support group or anything like that can really help seeing I'm not the only one going through this. Especially considering you have a class, that's like the perfect place to yeah, find that support. Meet people. Talk about this class. So our class is on the first and last Thursday of every month. Um, it's about a two hour class and we just go over the basics of breastfeeding. Just, you know, what a good latch looks like, what it can do for mom and baby, and just we have videos and pictures and we just really kind of go over so they have that good information before they even start. Okay, so when you've had new moms come in, I mean, do you see automatically their stress level go down? I mean, because knowledge is power. Yeah. You do, because a lot of them see it beneficial because they're like, oh, you know, I never knew that, you know? And so it's nice to know some things before you just walk into something because it's already going to rock their world, so. <laughs> going to rock their world. <laughs> Get excited about breastfeeding. All right, so how can people sign up for this? Uh, you can go to our website, our East Cooper website, and you can sign up for the class online. Um, you can either sign up online or there's a phone number that they can call. So should dads come to this? They can. And what would their role be in it? So um, as far as for partners, they can help assist mom and just make sure that they're comfortable, take care of the other stuff so that mom can just focus on breastfeeding. So if there are new dads out there and you would tell them how they could support their um, wife or their um, significant other in this process, what would you say? Just do whatever she, she wants you to do? Basically. <laughs> just listen to her, make her comfortable. Yes. and things things will turn out just fine, right? Mm -hmm. Right. All right, well, thank you so much for all that wonderful information. And for more and to sign up for this class, you can go online to eastcoopermedctr.com.